Hello, my name is Adrian Lovrick and in this video I will show you how to test a GSM mobile phone signal flash LED that you can use to play or to reduce the radiations. This is the result of my collaboration with the Lectana project researcher Paul Jaffe and the work continuing on this project that is about energy transfer. This module uses ST Microelectronics 1N5711 diodes a cheap alternative to 1SS86 Hitachi diodes. The Chinese 1SS86 diodes doesn't work. Also other diodes besides ST Microelectronics or Hitachi will not work on this project but ST Microelectronics 1N5711 are very cheap for now in 2021. The, the 1N5711 diode contacts act as antennas together with the LED diode contacts. You can calculate their shape and length depending on the frequency for which you want to capture energy. In the case presented here I wanted to capture the energy for the mobile phone GSM 3G and 4G frequency. To achieve this I had to make a triangular, rhombic shape from the metal contacts of the diodes. If the shape and length is linear and not triangular, the module will capture 2.4 GHz wireless power. As presented in the Lectena project. The module will not work in these modes on LTE or 5G GSM networks. For these two frequencies you will have to find shapes and lengths of the diode contacts that resonate on these frequencies as well. Pay attention to the LED polarity which must be reversed by the STM diodes in the circuit. It must be borne in mind that the diode module must be held in front of the telephone antenna. The location of the phone antenna differs from model to model. The more parallel 1N5711 diodes you connect in parallel, the more current you will generate on the LED. On classic phones that are not smartphones, the device works much more strongly as well as near GSM antennas. The device can also be made using SMD components. The frequency of the GSM signal can be different in multiple countries, the device has been tested in Europe on devices compliant with European standards. We noticed that the 1N34A signal diodes also have these characteristics but more weaker. During the tests, the function on the phone called wireless call must be deactivated so that the device to only works in GSM mode and to not make calls via the internet. If possible, use low power LED diode. I used 1.7 volts 20 mA red LED. Don't forget to try both polarity if the circuit doesn't work. Watch also Lectena project videos. The LED contacts can be manually twisted with those of a diode or can be welded with the soldering iron. If you encounter problems you can contact me, write to my email address in the description or contact the initiators of the Lectena project by accessing the link in the description. Lucky experiments and don't forget to subscribe to this channel, there are many other interesting and useful things for you.